on the hunt for some new summer kicks. We've purchased and tested dozens of pairs in the past six years, with the 14 best women's sandals in this review. We spent months trying out these products side by side. Miles of urban hiking, backcountry jaunts, neighborhood strolls, bike rides, and even trail runs have acquainted us with every strap and buckle. At this point, our intrepid team of non-stop explorers knows what makes for the right sandal in any situation and for every foot shape. We rate each option on key factors like comfort, adjustability, and, yes, style. Then we consider their cost to refine our final recommendations. This review includes options for varied adventures, long-haul hiking, and lazy camp days. The first product on our list is Chaco Z Slash Cloud 2. The Chaco Z Slash Cloud 2 scores near the top of the charts across the board, but its durability and comfort specifically make it a great choice for long-distance hiking. This model features one of our review's best traction performances, combining underfoot traction with foot-to-shoe interaction that allowed testers to feel comfortable and secure no matter the terrain. With a comprehensive adjustment system that can hug each foot area, this product is a favorite. We love that its toe strap provides extra support on the trail but can also fold down as needed to accommodate socks. Though we love them, chocos don't work for everyone. Their footbed is sculpted and doesn't break in much, so if you have flat feet, they are unlikely to feel comfortable. The adjustment system is tricky to figure out at first, and it's not conducive to quick readjustment when you need it. These also aren't the lightest options we tested, though we feel that their extra heft lends stability during long days on the trail. All in all, if these fit your feet and you're ready to get out after it, we're pretty sure you'll be in love. The second product in our list is Teva Original Universal, Women's. This retro-looking option delivered strong performance across most of our testing metrics and comes in at a surprisingly friendly price. The Teva Original Universal is comfortable, simple, and easy to adjust, and it offers great traction across a variety of terrains. It's a particular rock star in watery environments. If you're looking for laid-back, old-school style, you've come to the right place, this model looked great in the 80s, and it looks just as good now. Even more compelling, it comes in a ton of awesome colorways, so you can find the option that suits you best. Though this is one of our first picks as a casual or recovery sandal, its floppy sole, and imprecise adjustment mechanisms make it inappropriate for heavy-duty days in the backcountry. It feels unstable over super technical terrain or when wearing a heavy pack, and when you really crank down on the straps to achieve a secure fit, they rub and get uncomfortable. If you're looking for footwear to take you everywhere, this probably isn't it, but for casual and light outdoor use, the original Universal is a great value. The next product in our list is Keen Clearwater CNX. Keen has long been a purveyor of sturdy footwear options that score high in versatility despite their bulky profiles. The Keen Clearwater CNX upholds the brand's standard for adaptability while bucking the trend for bulk, and its sleek footprint made it our top choice for adventure travel. A comfortable, contoured arch cradles the foot, the rubber toe ensures safety from pebbles, rocks, and branches, and the latest version of the shoe is remarkably lightweight. Our one gripe with this model is the lack of a heel strap adjustment, which makes quick on and off and use with heavy socks difficult. This is also one of the slimmer versions of Keen footwear, and those with wide feet might want to look elsewhere for a more comfortable fit. The style leaves something to be desired, and it's not our first choice for active footwear we'd also wear out on the town, but this shoe is versatile for hiking and water sports alike and is a great choice for many outdoor pursuits. The next product is Luna Oso Flacco Winged. Most people are looking to raft, bike, hike, and lounge in their sandals, but what if you're a little crazy and you're on the hunt for something that will let you run free? Well, friend, then check out the Luna Oso Flacco Winged. This super pared down, thin soled kick has outstanding traction and a secure strap system built to keep minimalist runners happy. After a few skeptical test runs, this model fully converted our lead tester to minimalist running, and she now puts dozens of miles per month on them as her primary trail shoe. 
If you're interested in dipping your toes into the minimalist running waters, the Oso Flaco is an excellent introduction. When you're not running, the party screeches to a halt. This model is pretty uncomfortable, something about the running motion seems to align the straps better with the foot, and this magic fades when you slow to walking speeds. The strap system is difficult to adjust at first, and it's too thin sole to be comfortable on bike rides. If you're looking for an all-around sandal and not just an intro to running free, give this model a pass or, at least, be sure you can try them on before buying to ensure you like the way they feel. The next product is Zero Z Trail Ev, Women's. Our reviewers were impressed by the lightweight and comfortable design of the new Zero Z Trail Ev for women. Comfortable right of the box, the three-layer, 10mm thick soles are soft and flexible. The flat, zero-drop soles allow for a more natural posture and more traction as you can feel the ground more easily underneath your feet. But even if you don't plan to do a lot of hiking in these minimalist shoes, they are our favorite choice to throw in the backpack and change into at camp after a long day in hiking boots or to deploy for a quick creek crossing. They are not the most robust in our lineup, and we found that our feet often slid uncomfortably to the top of the shoe while hiking downhill no matter how much we tightened the strap. The footbed also becomes slick when wet, causing some instability. But these can't be beaten for how light and comfortable they are, and you'll be so happy to pull them out of your bag at camp to relax in after a long day on the trail. The next product in our list is Olakai Apenna. The Olakai Apenna is somewhat unique in this review in that its design is not really for rugged use. While this model can't compete with the more technical options in the backcountry, it deserves mention for wearing at home and around town. It is one of the most comfortable and stylish models we've ever worn, and our testers rarely take it off around the house. Its footbed is slightly molded and supportive enough to remain comfortable walking to the coffee shop and on easy bike rides around the neighborhood. If you're not planning to do any water sports or trail hiking, but are looking for a stylish footwear option that's more supportive than a flip-flop, the Apenna deserves your attention. Though a bit pricey, this is typical from Olikai. However, rest assured you're getting a well-crafted shoe made with premium materials. Alukais are also surprisingly water-friendly, despite having leather components, due to the Hawaiian influence and focus. Still, the Apenna falls short in the adjustability category and isn't nearly as rugged as other options in this review. If you need something to take you on a rafting trip or a through hike, this simply isn't it. On the other hand, if summer for you means beaches, bistros, and bars, this is one model to consider. Thanks for watching and hope you liked it. As always, all the links about the products will be in the description below, so if you want to find the best prices, and more information that we might not get a chance to mention in the video, be sure to check them out.